Wow Factor. The Wow, the wow Factor. I'm extremely excited to be in the Wow Factor because I've always, I always, um, I've always loved singing since a very young age, and um, I always watched the X Factor. So when I heard the Wow Factor was coming, I just, I was just so excited to do it. I just needed to do it instantly. My parents, my family, they're always encouraging, encouraging me to do the best I can. They're never disappointed if anything comes out wrong. They just, they're always strongly believing in me, and they're always um, putting me, they're always putting me to the test, and at the same time encouraging me to keep going and to never stop really made me excited to think I have that possibility of going to the finals and if I was able to go to the finals it would just be it would just mean a lot to me and it would just encourage me to move forward to what I really want to do and that's obviously to sing Ladies and gentlemen Christian Fox It's a new life for me, and I'm feeling good. Fish in the sea. Dragonflies out in the sun, you know how 
Gibraltar. From Gibraltar. Anyone from Gibraltar? Christian, Christian, let's go to Laura. Laura, let's have Christian. What are, you're, you're the. Well, you're the only solo male in this whole competition. How does that feel? Um, I guess um, I'm happy in one way, upset in another way because there's not enough male contestants. But I guess I'm proud to be here anyway. So there you are. How about that? I, I think you're you're 17, no? Yeah. 17 years oh, old. No, now this voice. Laura, let's go over to you, Laura, my love, and tell me what you think. It's difficult to end the show. That was our last act, yes? Yeah? Yeah, yeah. And I must say that as a boy, you're one of the only boys in the competition. Um, the only thing I can say is I'm moving to Gibraltar. <laughs> <laughs> brilliant. Me too. Absolutely brilliant. That was, that was just perfect. I just... Oh, you're better than anything in the X Factor, in my opinion. Oh, We're not going really. to lose him. We're going to keep him here. Christian. Christian Farley's here. Put your hands together from Gibraltar. Well done. Yeah. Christian Farley. Ladies and gentlemen, that brings the first half of the show to an end. I want to go through the judges very quickly. They've got a difficult job. Let's talk off with this. Start with you, Jason. First half of the show over. Your opinion as quick as possible. I mean, I think get into the mic there. Eat the mic. This has been very, very high with the standard. I've had a thoroughly enjoyable evening. Uh, considering that this is a charity concert, we've done very well. Thank yeah. you, Jason. Rowetta, enjoying it so much. Just flown in this morning. Rowetta got up at about what time did you get up this morning and oh, come silly here? Silly time. Quarter to five or something. Quarter but, to five to be here for Kudeka and for you, the audience. Don't, but, don't and, forget, Rowetta will be performing. She will be performing. I just, I, I'm just amazed by the talent. It really is better than the X Factor for me this year. They were just brilliant. The young girls, the young lad there, just brilliant. The boy band, the girl band, there's everything tonight. The cabaret, it's been a bit of everything. It's been a brilliant, brilliant show and everybody's been fantastic. I don't know how we're going to pick six. Great audience. You, the audience, are fantastic. Laura, just a quick word and we'll just move it on. I'm, I'm sure Steve will second it, but as somebody who lives here on the Costa del Sol, has lived here for a few years, who's worked with a lot of talent, I've never seen anything like I've seen this year. And I'd like to say big congratulations to not just the contestants, but to all the mums and dads and family and fans who've supported them, because we know that's where it comes from. And our chairman. Che don't forget, Stephen is the new. You, actually, we didn't do this because it's the consul. Oh yeah, we need to bow. Uh. It's not often we have royalty here, that's why. <laughs> Stephen, Thanks. you got some passports, I'm dealing with it afterwards. Go on, Stephen. <laughs> Laurie, shut up about the passports. <laughs> what can I say? I mean, only what the judges have said, fantastic. And now we've got to go and pick six. So yeah. for the six that we don't pick already, we're sorry, but you can see the standard is huge. So bear with us. You've got a huge job. Yeah, hopefully we'll pick job. the best six. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time we went to pull those curtains. You've got exactly 15 minutes. Give yourself a round of applause. You're an amazing audience and an amazing night. Thank you. We'll be back in 15 minutes with the final six. Thank you. And Rowetta, don't forget that.